As we've seen in the past, when the government talks about limiting gun access, more people want gun access. In Arapahoe County, people are lining up at 5 in the morning for a chance to get a concealed handgun permit. Denver 7's Eddie Guajardo explains why. Before the sun rises, a line begins to form outside the Arapahoe County Sheriff's Office. About 5. 45, 540. Nick Stanfield woke up at 5 a.m. to snag a spot in line. Yeah, second time here, yeah. He didn't make the cut on his first visit. This is actually my third time. And neither did Levi Ortiz. So the day I showed up early, and it was already like 17 guys in the line. The Arapahoe County Sheriff's Office hands out 35 concealed handgun permits three days a week. The earliest people arrived around 5 this morning. By 6.30 this morning, there is already 35 people in line and more still arriving. We're actually seeing uh, higher numbers. Deputy John Bartman says they tend to experience an increase in concealed handgun permit requests in the wake of a mass shooting. We asked Nick, why now? I think it'll be something that's only going to be harder to get later on. On Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays, residents can apply for concealed carry permits on a first come first serve basis. On average, 50 people show up before the doors open at 7 a.m. In 2019, the Arapahoe County Sheriff's Office processed about 3,700 permits. In 2020, 4,900 permits. From January through April of this year, 1,700 permits have been processed and Bartman expects to break the 2020 record. Concealed carry. Nick was part of the second group and was asked to come back at 9 a.m. They took his picture, his payment, and fingerprints. It'll take about 90 days to get his concealed carry permit. Part of that problem that we're having is CBI is backed up. Records show from 2019 to 2020, the Colorado Bureau of Investigation saw a 21% increase in background checks for concealed handgun permits. When we compared the first two months of 2020 and 2021, we found background checks for concealed carry permits spiked 73%. Nick's advice? Show up early. Have your paperwork in order and make sure to check your local sheriff's office guidelines online for any changes. Addie Guajardo, Denver 7. Addie, thank you. The Arapahoe County Sheriff's Office isn't alone. The Douglas County Sheriff's Office saw an 83% spike in concealed handgun permit requests in the first three months of 2021 compared to last year.